guys, it's seven minutes past 10 in the morning, 10 degrees. It actually feels a hell of a lot colder than that. So me and Holly were up quite early this morning and um, she's just refusing to eat. And I think that's just down to her cold, really. You gonna say hello? Hello. Okay, now sit up properly. Okay, that's fine, they heard you now. Yep. So, we're just on our way in because, the reason being, um, have you ever heard of tea pigs? It's like a brand of, that sell tea bags in pyramids and they're really quirky and not so long ago I did a tea pigs haul. You will find the video in my extensive list of videos. Um, but it's their 10th birthday today so quite a lot there's over 400 stockists um, that are giving away free tea pigs today and there's only one that was in a five mile radius of me and then the next nearest one was 13 miles away and we're gonna go up to the cemetery to see my mum and we're gonna go to the big park we're gonna go to the park aren't we Holly you were telling the horses that we're going to the park yeah so yeah that's pretty cool so i haven't been feeling very well this morning at all i've been on the toilet all morning sorry if that's tmi but i feel rough as a dog but i have managed to have three cups of tea now and they've stayed in and some porridge and a banana and that stayed in as well so very good Hopefully that's the end of that. So I've been looking at beauty advent calendars. I've never had one before. And I know they're probably not really worth the money, but like, I feel like I want one just to sort of get it over out of my system because I don't really want a chocolate one this year. I probably will have a chocolate one this year, but last year I ended up having two chocolate ones that I had made myself one chocolate one that I had bought for myself and then Holly had one that I bought for her she didn't end up eating it because she just didn't like chocolate so I ate that and then my dad sent one for Holly as well obviously a chocolate one and she didn't eat it so I had five chocolate calendars last year and I just think that that's a bit excessive so this year I could either go and buy 24 one pound makeup product things or just buy myself a calendar which obviously will be more expensive but I really like the look of the next one because you get 12 eyeshadows and 12 lip creams the soft matte lip creams which I really like um, I love the texture of them I love the way they dry down and I know that they last and I've only got two of their colors of that already but they're like the miniature versions and i'm thinking well that's cool really because who actually uses a full tub of a product especially makeup these days before it goes manky anyway so there's my logic so i don't know i've got boots points on my cards that i could use so i could potentially do it that way so then i'm not actually spending any money uh, I don't know have you guys tried any beauty calendars in the past and would you recommend them if so which ones and are you going to be getting one this year and if so which ones are you get in
guys. Why? I'm trying to like fake it till I make it today, but it ain't working. I'm trying really, really hard. So I went down to Mumbles, went to Mumbles Coffee and got my free tea, which was awesome. And then we went to Boots and got some Calpol because Holly's got a raging cold and we just used the last drops of our Calpol last night. And then we went to the park for a bit, which was nice, but like really cold. Like I was like, I wish I had more clothes on <laughs> and I've already got like a long sleeve top on and my jacket and my scarf and my gloves like I probably could have done with like an extra layer on the top so it would seem to be like my hands and my top half that was really cold and then what did we do then so then Holly fell asleep in the buggy and then I went up to the cemetery to see my mum which was nice because it was like in the sunshine and it was like really warming on my skin so I sat there for a while while Holly was still asleep, which was really nice and peaceful. And then, um, yeah, we've come home and that's it really. Um, just had some lunch. Oh yeah, when I was out and about, my stomach went all dodgy again. I was just like, this is not great when you're out and about because you need to kind of be close to the toilet. TMI, I know, but like, I don't know what I've done to like make my stomach like this. So... It's the weight gods it is. It know they know I've got to have a way in tomorrow, so they're making me crap it all out. So yeah. Hmm. <laughs> I've just had a banana sandwich. See how that feels, but I can feel it's hurting my stomach already. I can feel my stomach going, I don't know about this. So I just don't know what to do. Really. I wanna go for my walk as well, but again, like I don't wanna be caught short because there definitely ain't no toilets up there that's for sure so so no we'll see how I feel I'll give it an hour or something and see how I feel and if I'm fine in an hour then I'll go for my walk that's the plan that's the plan anyway so I reorganized my lip drawer this morning um usually like in here usually in this one I've got all lipsticks and usually in this one I've got all things like liquid lipsticks, lip liners, everything else that's not an actual lipstick in a bullet. So, but I've, I've changed it all around. So I've like changed it to summer and winter or what I perceive to be summer and winter. So all like my pinks and stuff and oranges and stuff are staying in there. And all my purples, reds and nudes have come in there for me to use. So I wanna like move away from those now. What, what are you giving me? You're giving me an apple. Thank you. Thank you. And then, yeah. So that's why I've got red on my lips today. I really like it. This is my Sephora one. I really, really like this because it just stays into place. Like I've had a cup of tea. I've just eaten my banana sandwich now. And I've had a few cups of tea in my other one. And it's still perfectly intact. Are you? We're not jumping on the bed. We're not jumping on the bed. Those are new rules. New rules. Are you moody? Are you moody? Are you moody? Are you moody? What's on your top, Holly? Panda. Good girl. What colour is a panda? And <coughs> yellow. No. Stripies. Stripies. Yeah. Oh yeah, the stripy leggings that Granddad bought you. Ah. Can you give mummy a kiss. No. No. Ah. Mm. Give mommy a kiss. Give mommy a kiss. <laughs> right, say bye-bye. Bye! I love you too! Thumbs up! Oi! <laughs> <laughs> Gang. So, 
I have a really, really nice candle burning. It's one of them wood whip ones that flickers. Makes me happy. It smells really like, it's a delicate smell. It's not like really potent. It's in the smell, wood smoke. So when you walk into the room, it smells like a fire, which is just right up my street. I love the smell of smoke. Um, odd, but I like it. Um, I also like the taste of it as well. Like the taste of bonfire. Does that make any sense? I really like that. But anyway, what have I been up to this evening? I went for my walk. I absolutely hated every minute of it. But then I had a cup of tea with my neighbour. Then we had dinner and then my belly got bad again. And yeah, that's annoying. I don't really understand how that's happened, if I'm perfectly honest. And I was intending to sit down and watch some prison break tonight. Either that or Hotel Transylvania. And neither has um neither has materialized because i've been looking at lingerie and then i've been looking at christmas presents for holly and commenting back on all of my comments on my youtube videos from you lovely people so yeah i'm gonna go to bed now because i'm up early ish for Weight Watchers, and yeah, Ugh. me, see you all tomorrow, bye.